Okay guys, so the next thing we're taking a look at here is my AH6 Little Bird Custom Troop Transport Variant. This was quite a lot of fun to build. I basically got a second chopper strike set, took apart the missile pods that attached to the sides and the way it's attached, and kind of went and got some spare parts and rebuilt it to make it into a variant that could support four people on the sides. So if we angle the camera down a little bit here, move the tripod a bit and zoom in a bit we can see the main modification here is obviously the seating for troops and we have a little attachment point here with a single stud exposed where you could put in the grapple hook piece that comes with the original set in order to allow somebody to rope down from it I think it's in this set it's included yeah there is some sort of string feature included in this set and then the main bulk of it is these two chairs. Now the actual AH6 Little Bird Special Forces variant in real life has benches on the side and the troops are kind of not secured to anything. They just sit there, they're quite exposed and it doesn't really have any sort of seating features to it. It's quite a standard looking bench. But with this one I didn't have the pieces available to make a bench sadly because if I had made a bench I would have wanted some kind of safety structure going up and around that the figures could hold on to and at this moment in time I just don't have the parts to achieve that sadly so I've kind of gone for a seated look instead where if we take a figure we'll take a Spartan for this even though it's a Call of Duty review because the Spartan is the only figure I have available to me we can actually just clip a figure in there and sit them on the side and it doesn't look that bad so my main focus with this custom was to try and get the seating as close to the body of the vehicle as possible because the little bird itself has the benching mounted very close to it indeed so I tried to get it mounted as close as possible without affecting the playability of the model and I'm quite happy with how it's turned out. One main thing I focused on was enabling it so that we could have a figure seated here and we could have benches mounted without it affecting this being able to open and it doesn't so that's quite good as well as that if we take a quick look at it from the front we can see it, it does actually have some quite nice look to it it's not that bad it does look quite uniform and it does look quite nice so i'm quite happy with how it's turned out overall we bring that back in quickly we can see it's the exact same on either side i've gone for a uniform look and we do have some additional blocks underneath it just to mount it into place that might get refined in the future i'm not sure yet okay so that guys has been a look at my custom ah6 troop transport variant helicopter for the call of duty line very very happy with how it's turned out and i hope that you guys like it the next video will be a look at the custom city you see in the background here so i hope you guys are excited for that and until the next time this is tom have a great week